important is it that you want of me? Talking to yourself, Udred? Or is this you at prayer? I think I'm cursed. Then consider me the cursed slayer. Call me a foolish old priest, but I sent you a trouble. Ethelhelm has joined with the Scots to take Northumbria, and he's launching his rebellion from Bevanbar. <laughs> <laughs> that is a strange twist to fate. <laughs> it's not strange at all. My gods are doing it to taunt me, to tempt me from my duty to my family. Why would they do that? What have you done? <laughs> well, that I never understand. Mm. All I know is that for most of my life, I've given my sword to Wessex and it drew me away from my family. Stuart thinks it was my choice, but... Not so sure. Sometimes I think that my fate is to wander and to never arrive. You've served the House of Wessex with much honor. I've worked hard for Alfred's ambition, yes. But my own kin suffered for it. They brought you Ethelfled. And then she was taken. The gods are cruel. Hmm. And now they offer this? All life is a test, true. But my God does not want you to fail. Perhaps there is design in this that is benevolent. <laughs> and perhaps you are not meant to choose between your fate and Alfred's ambition, between your children and his. Perhaps you are meant to serve both. How can I serve two masters? But what if there's only one master? One God, one destiny, many branches. Yes, yes. One tree. That is where our beliefs differ. And this is where I will insist. Think about it. You retake Bevanbow and ensure Northumbria does not fall to the Scots. In that act, you find a home for your bloodline. You're saying that it is my destiny to make England for Edward. That all this wait for Bevanbow served a purpose. Maybe. <laughs> Your God has a sense of humor. Yeah, it seems he does. And do you want to accept this calling? Yes, I want to accept, but is it a path of destiny or, or of arrogance? Am I being tempted for a fall? Perhaps the threads my gods have woven. Perhaps they make a net to snare me. And when I failed the first time, that was the sign that I ignored when Father Bianca was taken. And it was a sign that Bianca believed in your mission. But perhaps you were not ready. I felt as ready then as I feel now. What if I fail again? And what if you don't? And what if you do? If you died in the doing of it, what would happen? All reputation lost, all bloodline left to Rome without protection. The shame would be heavy in Valhalla. But there is no shame in heaven. That is the beauty of it. So my advice would be, believe my God is on your side and that you do not walk alone. There is no God. Mm. Only the gods. Mm. <sighs> Thank you for your kindness. You could be right. Maybe they are on my side. <laughs>